and welcome to another weekly vlog um this one may be a little different we'll see how everything flows what i choose to record and things like that but just an update um on the last vlog you guys seen that i went to the choir chiro chiropractor for the first time um but i didn't get adjusted i just um i got an x-ray done um and just talked about what was going on with my back so today i am back and I don't know what type of treatment I might be getting or anything. Um, I know that they're going to discuss my x-rays with me. Um, so I'm actually a little nervous because I don't know if I'm actually going to get adjusted or not. Like as far as like my back being cracked. Um, but I'm also excited because if it can like release some pain, it will be awesome. Um, yesterday I did experience some hip pain like on just my left side, which is actually like very weird. Um, but it was just in my hip only. Um, it was really sore. Like, I could barely walk in a way. Um, but I think it was because I slept wrong. Because this morning I woke up and I, I was fine. Um, so, I don't know what that was about. But I'm here. Um, I was able to go to Publix before I got off. Well, after I got off and before I got here. Um, and I got this drink that I want to try. Uh, because I haven't been juicing like that. So, um working on trying to get back into the groove of that so hopefully like february i can kick off juicing again um and having juices prepared and everything i'm thinking about doing a day detox though because i just i just need it so my appointment is at five and it's 4 52 so i'm probably about to head in there now um just so that i can get myself together um because i think you have to kind of warm your body up a little bit before you actually like go through treatment i don't know how they're gonna do it being that this is my second appointment so yeah this is the juice that i got it's the carrot ginger turmeric and apple um and so i'm gonna try it out i got it from publix i think it was like what, three dollars maybe this is the drink Ooh, this thing is spicy. Ooh. I didn't expect it to taste like that. But then I have to remember it does have ginger and turmeric in it. So. Yeah, this thing is spicy. Alright, y'all. Let me go in here. I don't know if I'm going to record anything. Because I probably won't have time to record anything. But... Um, I'll keep you guys updated once I get, well, I'll give you guys an update once I get back in the car about everything, so. Alright, so I am about to leave the chiropractor. Um, it went really good. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was. Um, so my appointment was at 5, and I got out of there at 5.42, so it was like 40 minutes. Um, because he went over my x-rays. Um, <clears throat> so to narrow it down, to pretty much explain it, um i have scoliosis my neck is absolutely straight and it needs to be curved so um i have another visit on wednesday um and so pretty much they are going to um try to figure out the treatment plans for me what i need to do next what's the next um steps and all of that good stuff um so that we can get me back on track because my hips are also um on different levels in my shoulders so yeah i'm just all fucked up <laughs> um excuse my language i'm sorry i'm all messed up i'm all messed up bleed i'm all messed up <laughs> um but overall it felt good um the recommendation after you get adjusted is to make sure you drink plenty of water so good thing i've already been drinking my water but i'm gonna finish this off and fill it up when i get home um so yeah that is what's going on i came in at the time that i did come in um because he was like with my neck spine being so straight that raises a concern for things in the future um and he was like well now you have a, a grab on it so you can adjust it you can get it right before it gets worse um so that's a good thing to hear um and it explains so much with what's going on with my body um he also explained that's why i had hip pain yesterday it wasn't because of slept wrong it's just because my body is going through a phase um but also he explained that um i have 
month. That's why I've been having skin issues. Um, I was being sick for like, you know, getting sick so frequently, um, having scalp issues. Cause I know I mentioned that I was having hair problems that, that my spine at the, at my neck is the reason why I've been having all of these issues y'all. Like it is crazy how the body works. So I'm not going to go into too much detail because I mean, of course, you know, it's my business, but I want to share a little bit of it with you guys. Um, but I'm headed to the house. Bang was supposed to be cooking tonight since I had my appointment and I knew I was going to probably potentially be in there late. Um, I also went to the grocery store before I got here for a reason. So I didn't have to be out in the dark to be by myself. Um, so yeah, I'm headed to the house. Um, and I guess I'll update my mom and my husband let them know what's going on. been talking on this vlog or been back on the vlog to talk um but i feel like i need to give a few updates so one being um that i did get the job um i don't think i ever gave the update but i did get the job i got the offer letter yesterday um so that's awesome especially if you watched the last vlog then you know um that i did go to a job interview in person which was different for me um since 2019 I've never done that. <clears throat> so that was majorly different for me. Um, also, um, I talked about in my last vlog about going to the chiropractor um, and how I was super nervous. Well, update, initially, like my first visit was not a adjustment at all. Really the first visit, and I think I might do like a separate video too throughout the process, but I'll explain more of why I would do that because of the update that I have. Um, so pretty much um, the first visit was just me getting an x-ray done, talking to the doctor, like telling them what's going on with me, why I feel, like what pains I'm having, where I'm feeling the pains, all of that stuff. Um, so I just talked to someone, like talked to a doctor about that, and then they took x-rays. Um, he also took x-rays, not just for my lower back, but also for like my neck and my um, center of my back and everything. So all of that, pretty much the entire spine, he took a picture of it. Um, and then I went back the week after. So I had my visit on a Wednesday, I think, or Tuesday. I can't remember what day it was. It was sometime in the last vlog. Uh, but then my first um, actual adjustment was on that Monday. Um, so he went over my exams with me just by myself just to show me if I had any questions, all of that stuff. Um, and then after he did that, um, I had my first adjustment. I was super nervous, but everybody in the office was like, it's okay, I promise you, like, it's not you're not going to be hurt from it or anything. Um, you probably won't even feel it. We're going to stretch you to where you are like loosening up your spine, loosening up your body pretty much. And I was like, okay, cool. Um, so 
it actually was not that bad um it took literally maybe 30 minutes for them to do everything like him going over the x-ray and then him um doing um the adjustment well another doctor doing the adjustment um so yeah that was pretty cool um felt good actually but um the symptoms that i had from it and then like when i went so i went yesterday as well but that was just to bring my spouse with me so that they can go over the scans and the x-rays with him um just to let him know what's going on so with me what type of treatment plans that i will be on um and also i got another adjustment yesterday <laughs> I did not know I was going to get an adjustment yesterday until she was like, oh yeah, so go ahead and get stretched out. And um, so you go ahead and get your adjustment. I was looking at her like, huh? <laughs> so I wasn't mentally prepared for the adjustment, but it did not hurt. But I still wasn't mentally prepared. Um, so in the meeting that we had with him, my spouse was able to ask questions and everything. I also have videos, so I might actually put the videos in here. Um, just a little small snippet, just for you guys to like hear a little bit of what he said. Um, but I think I might do a separate video um, over the course because I am going to be having, for treatment wise, I have to go for eight weeks, three times a week, um, and just kind of get everything together, adjusted, corrected, all of that good stuff. Um, so honestly, uh, it's a, it sounds like a lot. It does. It is. It's for a reason. I promise. Like at first, I was like, "Damn, that sounds like a lot." But in it, I don't have the paper on me. Like I said, I think I'm gonna have to do a separate video of just just based on that itself, just so that it makes more sense and um, I'm able to explain it in a way that um, it's just surrounding around that video. Um, so that you guys, if you never experienced going there, that you will know a little bit more information of what to expect, what's in like all included and everything. So, especially, if, but it depends on where you go because not everybody may not be like that. So let me just put that out there too. Uh, but I think he says I get like four massages, uh, but they're like based on like focusing on one area of the body. It's not like a spa massage. Um, he's trying to explain it to me and then um, I have 24 visits that I have to come. They give me a thing to put on my neck like at night um, just to lay on it for like 10 to 15 minutes. Um, they give me a back thing to kind of get that together but because my back is like overly curved um, and my lower back, um, he's not really focused on giving me that to correct it but correct it through adjustment and massages. So, um, and what else? It's some more stuff included in there, but I just can't remember everything. Um, so yeah, that's that. That's the little update. I got our wedding video back, so I am going to post that. I got a new job. I'll be starting at the end of the month. Um, I am <laughs> heavily, consistently going to the chiropractor, um, and life is good. Life is good. I am going to detox my body in this process too because I need to get away from a lot of things that I've been eating and a lot of things I've been consuming. I haven't been doing terribly, but I haven't been doing amazing either. And I need to start putting my workouts back into my routines. But now that I'm adding this to my schedule, plus therapy, plus girl, y'all, listen, <laughs> it is a lot. Like, it's not that many hours in a day. <laughs> It's just like, as soon as I get off, I gotta go there. Then after I get there, I <clears throat> gotta go home, either cook, hopefully, you know, we have a system to where we're meal prepping and it's like consistent and we stay on flow with it and we, you know, do what we're doing now, kind of balance each other out. If one can't do it, the other one step in and help out. So that always feels good, but y'all, I'm just like, wow. <laughs> like, it's a lot going on over the next month or so. Uh, but like I said, I'm going to make a separate video because I never want to make these videos too long to where I'm just like, uh, like talking, 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 talking. Talk. I'm done ranting. I know I've been talking for a minute. So I'm going to go ahead and shut up and head home. But I'm stuck in traffic right now. So that's why I had a little time to talk to y'all. So yeah. the lower back down here. And then you'll see as we go higher up, how the body's compensated is it's pulled the head forward and, and made a, a flat or reversed curve in the neck. 
very smart by the body, very non-functional, very not or very inefficient for the body to be in, in the position that we're seeing here. Um, so we what we did is we adjusted her the other day, and then we put a weight on her head. So what you're going to see here, that's a head weight. You remember, remember mm -hmm. us putting that? Yeah. We tested her with two pounds of weight. And what we did is we measured the reaction. So same idea. You can see how, how this C2 bone, how it was like hinging forward this way, got much more vertical. The other thing that stands out is you see this gap here that was very compressed. Do you see how you start seeing space in there? Yes. And then she actually turned into a positive curve, which is very rare. That's why when I asked about soreness was my first question because of how rapidly that changed. Now, you don't look like this right now, so this is you with a weight. When we take that off, it does revert back to that, but this tells us the story of what protocol, what plan we need to put you through. All right, happy Friday. Um, so I just got me a new phone case, just got to the house. Um, I left work about 3.50, we could have left at three, but you know me, I gotta make sure I get all my time it's nothing like getting your full paycheck just saying sorry the sun is like overly saturated it's like literally beaming on the front of my car so i may look a very very sunny <laughs> um but i just got to the house went to the mailbox and i have my new phone case i just love this color i don't know what it is about green lately but i've just been loving it like i loved it at my wedding i'm loving it now like everything green I don't know why um so yeah i just got my phone case i'm gonna switch out this and then i'm put on my other screen protector because i took that off just to let my screen breathe um i do potentially have to get a new phone though because y'all i just i'm just terrible so the first encounter um i dropped my phone and coffee no the coffee um fell on top of my phone so like literally i was doing a pod my Nespresso machine, my phone was sitting right there and literally the cup fell over and it just went to my phone. So my speaker on the front of my phone, like to where you put it up to your ear, was already kind of like affected. But then it became worse <laughs> the last weekend. I think it was last weekend, yeah. Um, I had a bowl of cereal and don't ask me how I did this. I do not know. Don't judge me either. But literally I dropped the front of my phone into the bowl of cereal so not the speakers at the bottom where you would put your charger but literally i dropped like the top of my phone where you would talk out of with your ear i dropped it into the phone so now i cannot talk on my phone with the phone up to my ear i'll be like huh what you say <laughs> so i'll be like hold on well if you try to tell me something if you call me you gotta tell me something like i'm already automatically telling you like i'm sorry but i gotta put you on speaker phone because i cannot hear you otherwise so yeah that's the only function i can use the speakerphone and then my beats i use those whenever i have them in their charge and everything but sometimes like it's very staticky in my ear and i do not know why um so i just sometimes don't use that i just feel like okay i'll just resort back to speakerphone at this point so sometimes i just feel like that's point when i'm trying to use my beats but as they all let to say y'all eventually i'm gonna have to get a new phone literally i pay off this phone in october so i'm just like truthfully like to be completely 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 honest i'm just gonna pay out of pocket to get a new phone so to go in the house just kind of relax for a second um i've been like really into like discounts like coupons all of that stuff so we're gonna look into some things that may be a little cheaper what store to go to for different stuff um, for dinner for the next few days um, and then I like ordered for HelloFresh um, so that comes Wednesday so I'm excited it's two different meals so we'll have one for that Friday and then we'll have that one for that actual day so I'm actually excited because that will help out with groceries and everything because HelloFresh is like I think it'll be like 70 something dollars and that's just for two meals compared to like going to the grocery store trying to get one meal for that same price so just a little update so i don't ever want to see you have more bars on that side than the gas side what was the we going to for the 20th time Kroger.
Yes, I do. I have two notches and 68 miles now. Please go to the gas station first. Can we go to the grocery store first? We did that the last time. We got to the gas station after. You know how when your gas light came on, your only orders was whoops. But then tomorrow we have tomorrow to get gas. What the hell is whoops? You're going to be on the side of the road. We wasn't. We were playing in the yard. No. Yes, we was. We was at the stop sign. It's a Reese's. Now I might do that. It's a Reese's. I taste. You know them nut butters I used to get? That's what's on top of it. Mm. So it's not like a Reese's on top. But it tastes like a Reese's. Alright. I got the fruity pebbles, so I'm gonna try this one. I'm gonna see what it tastes like because I love the cereal. Like let's see. I mean it tastes like the cereal without milk. True for them. Tastes good. Mm -hmm. What would you do? I give it about seven. I mean, it's good, though. I'll eat it, but I'll give it about a seven. Um, and then I'll try your little Reese's one. I will touch your red, uh, red velvet one until you try it. And then I'll give this a piece of it. Yeah, I look at it. You got that little wafer on top. Mm. You really don't taste the peanut butter, do you? Mm -hmm. you really I do. I taste the peanut butter in it. Thank you. I taste the peanut butter in it now. I'm tired. But I'm not a peanut butter fan, so you can't go off me. So I give it a seven. Oh, I give it an eight. Higher than the. Uh... Yeah, because it has a good taste. I just don't like the taste of peanut butter. Yeah. Yeah. Then I got me a matcha with strawberries. So. Let's see how this tastes. Do I have to take the whole lid off? No. Poke it. Poke it. Let's 
supposed to be strawberry matcha and then green, like strawberry popping bubbles. Doesn't taste like that. Starbucks first to try it. Mm -hmm. Not even an eight, not a lie. Or maybe a six, a seven. Is that right? With Starbucks, you could have took it back. Now. 